Hi fire signs, Aries, Leo and Sagittarius, Ascendant, Sun, Moon, Venus, Rising. And to those of you that are cross-watching as well, welcome to your tarot love messages. In today's reading, we are going to take a look at your person and why is it that they're acting weird lately? What's going on with them? Okay, it is going to be a general reading, guys, so please just keep that in mind. If you're after a personalized tarot reading with myself, please feel free to reach out and inquire. I will list my email address below the video. So... What's going on with your individual? What's the reason for them acting strange? Them acting weird lately? Okay. Okay. There's something going on with this person internally. And it's beginning to manifest outwardly. This is why you're picking up this on this vibe. This is why you're picking up on this energy. Something is going on. Mm-hmm. And it's because they're avoiding communicating. You suspect, oh, you suspect something is up, right? everything was going really well even if this was an early um like if even if this was like early on in the connection you were getting on very well you know things were seeming things were flowing swimmingly well okay uh you guys just you clicked there was a good energy great vibe and then all of a sudden this person started communicating maybe less and less uh or it, he just it just feels like he or she may have been acting weird and started pulling away. It could be that your person may be slowly losing interest or is just seriously, is just right now unsure. Okay, they're considering, maybe they're considering a way out of this connection uh, because they're not sure whether they want to, you know, continue on or whether they want to stay in, in this connection. I don't, I don't think it's someone else that has their attention. It could be that, but I don't think it's that. I think it's more because of an internal t turmoil that is within this person. So, for example, even if they feel like they're losing interest, instead of communicating this to you, they're avoiding communicating that to you. Okay, They're avoiding their for their words to you know address what the uh, issue is. Because they'll, they'll feel guilty, you know, first and foremost, the conversation is going to be awkward and they don't want to have that conversation with you. They just want you to figure it out on your own. So this is why they're kind of pulling away and distancing themselves uh, from you. They could also be starting to act strangely because I don't think they're talking or flirting with other people. I don't think it's that. I just think they're more distracted maybe within their own worries um they're distracted maybe with something else that's going on and the relationship is then kind of falling to the wayside and it's not really a priority and again they're avoiding telling you maybe what's going on with them emotionally and they're avoiding telling you how they you know sharing their feelings with you and you know maybe they're not hoping to completely pull away for the long term maybe they're just hoping to give this a little bit of distance and maybe they think like i don't know in a, in some time this is just going to magically restore itself to normalcy i don't know maybe that's what they're thinking there's a lack of communication and i think that's what's really i also see they're hesitant though you want them to open up but this person is like shutting down. This person shuts down. And it's not your problem. And Sorry, it's not your fault. But I do see that this person has emotional blocks. And that's something that they seriously need to consider if they do want, you know, to continue this relationship or if they do want a relationship. I, I mean, most people have some walls, right? That's most people. However... And with most people, there probably are going to be things that they don't want to discuss or they don't feel comfortable discussing. But this is someone who's just flat out refusing to work and address a conflict internally 
or within the relationship. And that's why it's going to make it very hard for the both of you to build trust. I'm not saying that this person is not trustworthy. It could be, okay, could be. But the, re the way that they're acting does have symptoms of someone who can't be trusted. And it might be because this person has trust issues. It could be that. But I think that if there's, there's a reason why, you know, someone acts distant or weird, it's saying something about them, right? And I can see that this person is maybe not as engaged or as they once were. And it might not be because they don't want to be. It could come down, you know, their cold and distant behavior could come down to the fact that um, they have these emotional blocks which are preventing them from moving forward. I see that it is hurtful swords are a weapon so i can see that the way they've been acting lately has been hurtful um, but i think if you can try and communicate with this individual i know a lot of you are just met with like blockages but see if you can get them to speak up They could be, like, the fact that this person is silent could also be that they're wanting your attention, okay? They're wanting you to notice. And they're not really good with words or sharing their feelings, so this is their, their way of trying to communicate with that awkward silence. they're feeling a little bit off I feel like even if they are even if they are losing interest in you I don't think it's because of you I think it's because there are other things that are going on with this person for some of you maybe this is someone whom you begun out as you know this connection started out as a friendship and then evolved into something romantic um, for others of you, maybe this is something in the workplace and the workplace has their attention right now and, you know, the relationship or this connection is not being prioritized or this person feels that the connection might suffer as a result of some of these workplace issues. I know it's I know it's difficult for some of you, but I really feel like you need to sit down and you need to talk to this person. Okay, it might clear the air between the two of you. It might give you some clarity as well. It might give you an indication of what you know um, what their intentions are. I feel like a lot of it does come down to the fact that this person doesn't know how to express the, their emotions. The energy does feel off, and I don't feel like this person is being their usual self. I don't think they're mad. I don't think they're mad at you, but I do see that they've retreated and started to act, started to act very weirdly. I mean, Four of Swords here could be something you might have said as well. Could be something you might have said that was that they took very personally or that you know it really hurt them here it just could also look it might not even have anything to do with you again you're going to have to you know this one this one narrative is not it's not going to fit everyone's watching right so you might have to use you know you'll have to use your own discretion here because it feels like they may just want some time on their own, okay? They may just be exhausted. They may just be completely burnt out. They just may want to, you know, they might just feel like they could be introverted and they they just might feel like they want to spend some time on their own. They could have been long, they could have been working some very long hours and they might have been giving their time and their energy away to something else. Maybe especially towards something that's been very stressful maybe right now they just need some much needed rest but they don't know how to communicate that to you so it's coming across as them being distant to you when really it's just them wanting some time out so it's probably the best that you bring this to their attention and maybe just have a chat about it 
that way you'll be able to you know have a better idea of what it is that they're feeling and what's going on with this person maybe the relationship is just something that they, not that they, not something that they could do now or maybe they just want to slow down the pace because they have other things that they're you know focusing on all right guys and these are your messages thanks so much for watching and listening appreciate your support by liking sharing and subscribing to the channel bye